Hello guys, welcome back to Aradha's Creative Mind. My name is Aradha and in today's video we are going to learn about area of rectangle and square. In previous videos we are learn about the perimeter of area and rectangle. In today's video we are going to learn uh, perimeter of area and rectangle and in today's video we are going to learn about area of rectangle and square. So previous one we have learned about perimeter of area and square. And in today's video, we are going to learn about area of rectangle and square, okay? By uh, the today's route. Now, definition of area. Area is amount of surface a figure covers. I am repeating. Area is the amount of surface a figure covers. Now, area is definition. This is area is the amount. Area is having some of amounts like 4 squares, 8 squares, 9 squares and without counting or wasting time on its counting, there are shortcut methods of finding area in today's video. So, area is the amount of surface. Surface means, surface means a plain surface, plain smoothing place or area is known as surface a figure covers. Now we have to check a mobile a mobile figure. If we keep on a square line book, then we have to check it how much squares are figures in it. So they will be the area of our mobile. Like we are going to see about area of rectangle. Area of rectangle is equal to length by breadth. Formulaic method area is equal to italic handwriting. I have write for explanation to you. L by breadth. L means length. B means breadth. Is equals to 3 by 4. Now you can see in the picture there is 3 length and 4 breadth. So 3 4s are is equals to 12 square unit. You have to give square units. Otherwise you will not get marks in exams or other things. Because it's all about area if you are going to see about perimeter then we have to give p is equals to dash 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 means which is answer area of square area of square is equals to side by side means you can see here is also three here is also three and if you will know that's what to do inside and side area is equals to s by s means side by side is equals to three by three now first try this three again side is also three in square you have to remember that all sides are same that time it is square if there is four in one side and five in one side it is rectangle if there is three in one side and six is one side it's a rectangle but when there is three three or a similar similar double letters that time you can understand that it's a square now Let's do three threes are three threes are nine squares unit or otherwise you can count it but they there will be wasting of time in a shortcut method we can do like this thanks we will meet in another video in today's video you learn about rectangles so in another video we are going to learn about other things till that bye to my friends.